So what I have here is a Google image. This is only 2K. This isn't as high as you can go. But this is just to show you how to do this. Um, basically, it's a you know 2048 by 2048. It's one by one. Being, I mean, it's power of two. Um, I'll take this image and I'll stick it in small grid. So I have a terrain block I made in here just for the purpose of uh, doing tests on and stuff. So we'll go into small grid and I'll make a terrain paint with that material. So this is exactly what I did with my um, track I'm working on now. But I ended up not really using it as much. And instead, instead I ended up using a 3D model instead of the paint, but the, tur the, the paint works too. What you'd have to do is go into your material editor and uh, go to your terrain painter. Now this is for not PPR converted levels. This is for the old, older, where you just get four little things instead of 18 of them. <laughs> <laughs> this is, uh, I basically I'll use the macro or the diffuse which in this case you can use the diffuse but uh, and just but you got to have something in the macro and in the detail even if you're not uh, gonna use them let me just show you what I'm talking about So I'll put the macro down to like 0 .0, 0 .01, some ridiculously low number because I don't want to actually be using it. And uh, same thing with the detail. I don't need to see that. Just this. And the size, uh, I guess 20, 2048. And yeah, you see. Uh, also, another note, your terrain block, when you double click on it, you got its maximum resolution uh, it can only go up to 4096 by 4096, even though you can use um, larger terrain textures, the render size in the game will only be 4096 by 4096 if you use this as a terrain block. And see, this is 2K. It'd look a lot better with 8K. Sure. You know, yeah, it'd look a lot better. Like, that would be even better. Um, so, so, yeah, you can most definitely do that. And it makes it a lot easier. Because um, you basically got all this like a paint by number, you know? It's basically a paint by number at this point. You just have to fiddle with what size it needs to be, of course, because you know, you want a road in here to be similar to a road that's you know, if your car was parked on it, it's like you can See, these are actually little cars here on this little freeway. They've got such a low resolution, but you get an idea. You move your car over to here. And, you know, you're kind of in the ballpark. You know, that's pretty close, I'd say. Maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe this needs to be even larger. Uh, that looks pretty off, actually. Uh, let's see, 4096. Yeah, that's probably more like it. But you can really see how bad this low resolution looks. But like I said, this is only 2K. You can put a 16K in there. I'm sure it'll take a 16K image. And it'll look so much better than that. Well, you can imagine if you shrink this down... You 
you get a better idea of the resolution it's capable of. Sure, there's probably a point of diminishing your returns but you know you kind of get the idea you have a pretty damn detailed texture for a terrain paint 